Hey, we've just done the first floor run. Uh, so we are just uh, at the end of the rehearsal stage before we go into the theatre, which happens in January. There's a lot to learn. It's a very uh, physical role that I've got. I'm one of the rustics, uh, so there's a lot of kind of clowning around and things, but uh, no, it's, it's going really well. It's been almost a month of work, I think. Sometimes you lose the time of work here in this, <laughs> this place. There's so much, so many work that you do. Uh, but I'm quite happy. It's quite a challenging opera itself, and the production is quite challenging as well, which is good because it makes us improve. Uh, but I'm really happy, and I think the first stage piano that we did was really good. So awake when I am gone. It's such a special piece, and it's a wonderful time to be doing it to celebrate. 100 years since Britain's birth and I just think it's got something for everybody. The music is sublime and it varies a lot depending on which part of his world you're in. You have this amazing ethereal stuff with the fairies, you have this amazing comedy as well with the mechanicals, the very kind of brutish human characters. A lot of high drama as well with the lovers and the things that happen when those different worlds meet are explosive. I mean, Britain's music's all got a kind of certain style to it, but this time he's taken Shakespeare eh, and he's using kind of Shakespeare, Shakespearean text eh, set with music. Eh, there's some kind of cuts and things, but eh, so just getting your head around the Shakespeare before you even look at any of the music has eh, been a challenge, but no, it's great. And, and it's a comedy, it's got the love bit off it as well. But the great thing about this is it's got a really strong comedic kind of line running right the way through it. The, it's amazing to be in this conservatoire. It's just, uh, you can have everything. You just it, it's people from the entire world and you have such a, a, a range of uh, different disciplines and different courses as well it just makes it really you feel in an art world this thing together with Scottish opera is really really good this uh, conjunction the opportunity to perform in the Theatre Royal for example and it's a huge production it's, it's a professional production indeed I think, so certainly as an opera student, this relationship with Scottish Opera is so unique. There's nowhere else in the country, I don't think, that ha where you have the opportunity to work as a professional in a professional company, at the same, as it be part of your studies and part of your training. It's really special. Britain is a certain taste. Uh, the music is, you know, a, kinda, a certain kind of ilk of music. So if you wanted to try out contemporary music, then this is the one to do it because it's got so much fun in it. And there's lots of loving, fighting, joking, laughing. Uh, it's even a wee bit naughty as well. So it's great. It's really good. I think they can expect uh, lots of physicality going on on this stage. Uh, lots of love and intrigues between love. Lots of magic from the fairies and some surprises that I won't say because it's quite exciting.